you looking for fur? Oh, you, you the female? Not from here, are you? What gives it away? You just walked up to a police officer. And I have this funny feeling you expect something good to come out of it. right to the point. I recently got stopped at a fake checkpoint. Heard there was a cop around here who might know what I'm talking about. Draumir, he's a slippery fuck. Pays off all the right people, provides all these bullshit documents that prove he's legit. Regional inspector, my ass. I'm putting a file together. A file? This guy's dressing up like a cop and harassing hogs in the street. <laughs> Sounds like 90% of the people I work with. Listen. The right amount of coin in the right kind of pocket, fancy looking paperwork, those things go a long way in this city. Especially if the perception is that he's not really doing anything wrong. Just giving Oggs a hard time. There's more to it than that. That's exactly what I think. Why don't you fill me in? What's Drahomir been up to behind my back? There was a girl named Elena. The way she tells it, she was forced at gunpoint to work for Dramir. They kept her in a little room and made her forge documents for them. Why didn't she go to the police? She was scared. A lot of people are scared. Yeah, of course they are. Prague's going to hell. The bad cops don't care and the good ones are too busy filling out forms. Fuck it. Dramir has been pulling this shit for long enough and I'm sick of being told to ignore it. Official police business now. Stay out of it. I've seen Drachomir pretend to be many things. My friend was never one of them. It's been taken care of. He's not gonna be a problem anymore. Thank God. I don't know how you did it, but I'm glad you did. Listen, if you ever need documents for something... I'll be fine. Thanks. Sure, this will just open the door, right? Security rating one. Okay, go on up there. Capture and fortify. Fortify that. Are you serious? Okay, it's cool. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Is this restricted? Nobody knows. <laughs> it's part of the mission here. Oh, geez, did you see me?
I have a couple of books on my way out. Jensen, I'm getting worried. Should I be calling every police station in town looking for you? That's not necessary. I'll be in soon. Good, because we've got work to do. Find <laughs> some. Jensen! Thank God! I'm down in the dungeon, man! You remember the title of my super secret book, right? I remember it's red. Well, at least it was the only red book there. <laughs> My favorite techno wonder kind. Sorry about the goons, man. They, uh, they didn't give you too much trouble, did they? I stayed out of their way. What do they want? You behind on your protection money? I... I don't think it's about money. I got this little misunderstanding with their boss, Otar. You know how it is with these gangster types. Enough to know that there's no such thing as a little misunderstanding. The Valley internal politics. I... I'm gonna get it sorted. Gonna see the big boss myself. As soon as things settle down. The day after a bombing, man, it's... Well, I mean, it's scary, right? I'm surprised people go out at all. Sometimes people don't have a choice. My systems took a hit. I was hoping you could help me get everything running again. Took a hit? You mean... Oh, shit! Why didn't you say so? We need to get you in the chair. The chair. You know I've always wanted to get a closer look at those saddy fogs of yours. A real close look. So, <laughs> That's uh, not creepy. <laughs> so let's strap you in, get the gas going, and then, well, then I just need to sort of dive in. Huh? Feel my way around. What exactly are you gonna do? <laughs> what exactly are you gonna do to me? I'm not sure yet. First, I gotta get in there to see what's wrong. But don't worry. I'm not gonna do anything to you I wouldn't do to myself. I promise. Besides, <laughs> you've been here a few times. You know I'm professional. You've never had to put me under before. I never saw you the day after an explosion before either. That was a big shock to your system, man. 
Kaboom! Now, you want me to fix you or not? Yeah, go ahead. All right, let's just get this over with. Relax, Jensen. It's it's gonna be fine. You you won't even know I'm in there. You feel weightless, far away, like you're someone else. But Kohler's gonna bring you back and make you you again. Before you know it. <laughs> I don't trust this guy. <laughs> I swear I didn't mean to. Your retinal display should be back soon. You can still move, huh? Where, where did you? I was. I was trying to connect the unconnected. But you got some strange fucking ogs back there. I mean, I, I probably shouldn't have. Uh, here, let me get you some water. Or something stronger, maybe? Water. You got it, Jensen. Just, uh. Just ease up. Okay, don't freak out. Rebooting was the only way to save you. Save me from what, Carl? Core meltdown. You almost melted my chair. So I reset you, and I found these... these, uh... I think it's better if I show you what I found. Bring up your system display. You need to see this for yourself. These are your implants. You're familiar with all these, right? Yeah. David Seraph installed them. Took two years for my body to get used to everything. Right. Well... I had to undo some of that getting used to. What's going on, Kohler? Why do I feel different? Something was trying to vampire the juice out of you. I couldn't figure out what until after the reboot. Turns out your Factory Zero is not the standard Factory Zero. What am I looking at? Experimental fucking test dogs, man. Hidden inside your body. You're telling me I got more implants than I thought I did? More than your body can handle. Pretty cool, right? I'm not sure yet. I want to show you what happens when you activate one of these suckers. It's okay, Jensen. One isn't gonna kill you. You've said that before. See that? Major spike in your power consumption. Where the hell did these things come from? I can't answer that. All I know is the explosion must have woken them up. But man, you wanna use these crazy fucking things? That's your right. We just gotta make sure it doesn't fry you. Now, I think I maybe got an idea on how to do that. Try shutting down one of your other implants. You know, just for fun. Which augmentations can be disabled once selected? Press X to confirm. Go ahead, Jensen. Shut down I definitely one of the double implants take you're down. I guess I, I'm gonna have to go with Typhoon, guys. There it goes. Go ahead, Jensen. See that? Cooled you right down. You have the power to balance your system if you want. Just, you know, don't activate everything all at once. What would happen if I did? Well, you'd suffer some major glitches due to overheating. We're talking risk of permanent damage. So, you know, maybe don't do that. All right. Reset me now, Kohler. I'll reactivate what I need myself. Okay. So I'm not always gonna be there for you like this. I can't just follow you around to reset things and hold your neural weave together. Whatever choices you make from here on out, they're your choices. But you were supposed to be my AUG expert. I specialize in Chinese black market, okay? The shit I found hidden inside you, spliced into your system like that, looks to me like it's from Mars, man! I'm pretty sure they're not from Mars. I just... I feel bad. You deserve answers I can't give you. I can help manage your system better than anyone in Prague. To help you make the most of the new Augs we just found. 
But you can't tell me where the hell they came from. As far as I know, David Seraph installed all my hawks. There's something inside me I don't know about. He's the one I need to talk to. I am familiar with Saris' work. These new orbs, they... They look different to me. I mean, that neodymium shell. Who uses dimorphic magnetoreological fluid like that? Seriously, if you talk to Sarif, you need to ask him that. Shit really stands out. Pretty fucking cool, actually. This tune-up went longer than I expected. Let's wrap this up. Right. Here, take some Praxis kits for the trouble. Praxis solves everything. Keeps customers happy. Just, uh, remember what I showed you about managing your juice. It's gonna be a balancing act for you. Well, unless... Unless what, Kohler? There could be a way to optimize. It's just... It would involve getting something from Otar. A neuroplasticity calibrator. There's a way for me to use everything I have without compromise. I want to know about it. I was hoping you'd say that. I order all my fancy tech from this illegal catalog, right? But my last shipment got intercepted by Otar Botkoveli. The same Otar whose men were looking for books out there before? I am not going to force you. I want you to want to do it. I want you to want to be an augmented god among men. If that sounds like something that interests you, then you should know that Otar runs an underground casino in the Chisti district. The entrance is in a small courtyard off Hlavni Street. Thanks for the info, Kohler. Thanks for the praxis.